Hey yo, what's up everyone? This is Simple Teddy and today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to jailbreak your devices running the latest iOS as of now, June 2021. And take thought guys that what we are going to do right now is jailbreak using our Windows PC because this is a widely used operating system. Not all of us has an access on Mac. So let's start this video after this intro. Okay guys, for this process, we need to prepare some things. So first, we need a micro USB, at least 2 gigabytes, uh, that may work. Pero mas maganda if you have 4 gigabytes. What I'm gonna be using right here is, right now is, this iPhone 6s running iOS 14.6. And then we need to download some applications and one of it is the Balena Etcher. So download the Balena Etcher, just go to their website, type balena.io and then download it. So yeah, just click download for Windows. 64 dash or by 86 that means 32 bit all right guys next thing we need to download is the Checknix version 1.1.7 so this is the latest version of Checknix and for the link i will put it on the description so it's easy for you to find it make sure to remember the directory where you put the file open balena etcher and then install it so once balena etcher installed what we need to do is to plug in our micro USB. So once we plug in our micro USB, click flash from file and then browse and select Checknix 1.1.7. Okay, so once we selected the Checknix, select target and then select the USB drive. In my case, this is the Sandisk Cruiser Blade. Okay, select one and then just click flash. Okay, so once we are done with this, and now we're going to reboot our computer. We're going to boot on the BIOS. So it depends on your system, right? So if you don't know how to boot on BIOS, search it on Google on how to. It depends on your specific unit or specific laptop or computer. But in my case, to boot on BIOS, I just need to click delete. So once you are in the BIOS of your computer, we just need to change some settings here. Make sure to disable the boot security. Secure boot and disable. Place as first priority the USB disk that we used for this Balena Etcher. So in my case, I already set the SanDisk as the first boot priority. Now, let's click save and exit. And supposed to be, we are going to boot on SanDisk. You will put into these options. So what we have here is this option. So nakalagay dito is welcome to check next. So what we are going to press is the Alt F2. So once you press Alt F2, this window will pop up and this is the check range. Okay. So we cannot control it by mouse. So what we are going to use here is the arrow keys of our keyboard. Once we are here, we need to plug in our device. So let's plug our device. Okay, once we plug in, you will see that the check ring will going to read our device. So this said that iPhone 6 is supported but iOS 14 is not. If that's a problem, we just need to go to options using your arrow keys. Go to options and then hit enter. So once you are inside the options, just use the arrow keys up and down and select allow. Hit enter to mark it. And skip A11 BR BPR check. Hit enter to mark it. And um, select back and hit enter. We can now press the start button. So select start and hit enter. Now we have a warning here. Just hit OK. Next. Okay guys, so once we enter the recovery mode, we just need to click start and follow the on-screen instructions as usual. Hit enter. 
press home button and uh, side button then release side button just follow the on screen instructions and then release and then just wait okay now our phone will going to boot automatically and it says on our PC screen that it is done it just means that we successfully jailbreak our device running iOS 14.6 so once we are done we can now quit just press Control alt delete and our computer will going to boot but before we press Control alt delete we need to um, remove the USB okay so that's it guys that's that is how easy to jailbreak your device using your window okay guys so that's it that's is that is how we can jailbreak our latest device running iOS 14.6 using our Windows PC. So if you like this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and, and share this video. Hit the notification bell so that you'll be updated for my future uploads. Thanks for watching and God bless everyone. Peace.